Hi everyone, I'm um, out today on a walk in the Tessie Woods Country Park up in Northumberland. So I'll have a little wander and see what we can find. Having a dust bath so now. It's a bit of uh, a whiter shade now anyway. Oh. So I'm in Plessy Woods Country Park, it's quite busy today, a lovely sunny day. We're just going to head out the park and along the river towards Stanerton, where it's hopefully a little bit quieter. And uh, see what we can find, see what we can see. Wild garlic scattered along the riverside. Now I've been told you can eat that, and it's uh, quite tasty. Or you can ground it up and put it in your food when you're cooking at home. Um, but I think I'll give it a miss today. You can see the river so still and clear. Not many fish jumping today, but very peaceful. Beautiful. And here we're in the middle of the woods with the east coast main line running across this huge viaduct or bridge. Um, so I would imagine this will be called the Stanton Viaduct. Even in the middle of the woods, the people who built it took a lot of pride in their work. As you can see, they faced off all the stones, they made it with decorative as they possibly could even though there's probably only a few hundred people ever see this every year as opposed to something in the city centre you've got to admire these Victorians well I'm about half to around my walk beautiful lovely day lovely down here very peaceful so I thought I'd just stop and make myself a little snack um, I brought me a little stove with us today I got this off Amazon, it was actually a gift I got at Christmas of my sister. Um, 
and it's, it's a lovely little thing, quite cheap, you know, there are obviously better ones, jet boils, etc, but this will do me for now, so basically, you get your little pan, lid, gas cartridge that comes separately, I've got my little spoon, pull it out, Here is a little jet burner, and there's the big pan. And what I've done is just put a little bag in the bottom. So when you put your gas cartridge in, it stops the pan from getting all scratched. That's a top tip of the day. So basically, all you do is open this up. Very easy to do. Okay, put a piece of kit. Just it unfolds. Can't go wrong really. Just spin round. Put the little feet out for extra stability, take the top off the gas, like so, so just go between the hand, screw it on, there you go, that's your stove set up. You can get a little feed for the gas bottles to give it a bit more stability, which I think I'm going to invest in. Um, so yeah, so that's your gas stove set up. What I'm going to do is go put some water in the pot, give it a little bit for drinking all the way back, and then it's got a lovely little self igniter on. So you just turn this lever, and you hear the gas come out. With. Put the pot on and the water will boil quicker, just keeping the heat in. So we'll just give that a couple of minutes and when it's boiled, I'll add my lunch into there. Right, guys, the water's boiled, so I've got a mug shot from the local supermarket. I'm going to put that in, have a little bit of lunch. So, add that the water. Always take your little home. Always great. And then reset that. Turn the gas off. There's my soup boiling the way. Seen, please like and subscribe to my channel and I'll encourage me to keep posting videos on my adventures with my own attacker. Thanks again, till the next time. Bye bye.